Hi friends, I'm Mrs. Ragini. Today I want to share a very very basic dal recipe and that too with some moong dal and some lobia and some chana dal. Have you ever tried a dal with these three kind of dals? If you have not tried, please try. This is very very tasty and you know this is very very simple to make it. Just you need to soak this dals for you know for 2 to 3 hours or you know before sleeping you can just put the dals together and soak it for overnight and in the morning just you know put everything and you can just pressure cook it so isn't it very very simple to make this nice and simple dal so dear friends let's start how to make this as i said it's very very simple so what i am doing is i am just adding some oil in a pressure cooker directly and the tadka everything we are going to give it right now and we are going to pressure cook it or if you want you can cook the dals and then you can give the tadka whichever way you want this is an easy style to make it quick and fast so here little bit you know oil is hot then we are going to add some mustard seeds and some cumin seeds and also some red chilies if you want you can just break it and add it and these all you know we are going to pressure cook it so just add everything and now some onions also add some salt also if you want you can add some garlic also just mix it one and then some green chili and some turmeric just everything into the pan and pressure cook it and some red chili powder also don't worry about the onions it should not be you know soft or you know brown because because we are pressure cooking it we need not cook it too much and now just add the moong dal I have soaked it separately but you can soak it together some lobia and some chana dal just mix it nicely and as per taste just add little more of salt and you know once this is cooked then we can just check the salt and then we can add some more of salt mix it nicely and now add enough water because we need to pressure cook it and we want our dal to be nice and soft so you can add little bit extra water so here we are going to cover it with a lid and this we are going to pressure cook it at least for 5 to 6 whistles till our dal is nice and soft and that too in a very slow flame because we added good amount of water if you are going to increase your flame and cook it then your you know water may come out from the cooker so just reduce the flame and let it cook till you get nice 5 to 6 whistles so dear friends after 6 to 7 whistles i want the dal to be fully mashed so i have cooked it till 6 to 7 whistles for almost 10 minutes so here once this is cooled down just remove it and you know we need not do anything just check the salt and you can enjoy with nice rice or roti pulka anything just mix it once and just switch on the flame once and we'll just check the taste you can see the dals have nicely cooked see it's nicely mashed because we cooked in a very slow flame for six to seven whistles i think i need to add some salt because this is very less so some salt and you can just check the spices also if it is as per your taste you can just you know serve it like this directly or if you want little bit you know thick then you can boil it for some more time or you can just take a masher and mash it and you can make it little bit thick so whichever way you want you can just enjoy this nice simple added three kinds of dals i'm just going to check the taste ones even if you can see the onions because i sliced it very big and i can see little bit of onions also in between and those are nice and soft it cooked so perfectly so that's it put everything in the pressure cooker and your dal is ready so here in the last we are going to add some chopped coriander and switch off the flame so dear friends if you want to enjoy this nice dal please do make this the way i made it you're going to enjoy it like anything just have it with some small pulkas or roti or chawal you're going to enjoy it so this dal i'm going to enjoy with nice rice so see you in another session with some more very very nice recipes only for you guys